Hello viewers, welcome to our channel, The Bong Medicals. We are The Bong Medicals, me, Dibba Jyoti Mukherjee, and he is Jagabundu Pramani. And we are here to inform you about some valuable information about the test, the next test that is going to happen from our batch, the Unlucky Batch 2019 batch. So first of all, let us introduce uh, ourselves. So we are currently studying uh, in Arjigarh Medical College, Kolkata. Uh, currently part two, uh, yes, final, final year, year student. So we will give the next exam uh, for the first time, you all know. And uh, in this next exam, uh, everyone is uh, having curiosity in that how will it happen, what will be the pattern, how will be the mock test, how to register the mock test. So in this video, we'll discuss uh, the, uh, how About to... All the things actually. What is next, what is the steps to enroll yes. for the mock test and all that. If anyone uh, has not enrolled till now, so they can refer this video as a guide. Uh, and after that, they can fill up your form, okay? Okay. So at first, I'm here to say that what is next, it is national exit test. Okay, <laughs> I may be uh, somewhere wrong with my pronunciation but it is national exit test so uh, what are the components of next so we all know that next is divided into two steps actually next one and next two so what is your next one that is uh, the main exam that will determine your rank for the pg seats actually uh, from uh, the information and from the webinar <laughs> in which is uh, going uh, last last week so for that webinar so for that webinar we have to know that so next to that and this is the whole thing in the whole medical college and medical paternity we are the first batch who are going to face the next exam the next exam different clarifications are there that from November 2023 next will not happen it will first commence the exam from I think May 2024 so basically next to next one will be conducted in year in one year two exams will be conducted so first exam will be conducted in May and second exam will conducted in November these are the list next one and after that if we pass with 50% uh, marks then we will now uh, till now the information is 50% marks, marks we have to, we have to achieve in every subject okay every in every subject, subject. And there is negative marking also yes uh, in this mock test it is said that negative marking but uh, they can change in the original uh, next uh, exam uh, uh, uh. because negative marking if it is there then it is very difficult for all the students so let's see what will happen finger crossed okay so, so subject subject uh, variations please for next one there are three subject combinations as far i know that that uh, medicine uh, that will combine of uh, i think 120 questions or something yeah. and uh, with allied medicines there is a short subject and uh, that is uh, with 60 questions same uh, is uh, for surgery and same is for gynecology short subjects are there as ophthalmology otorhino laryngology and uh, your uh, ent and opta. ent opta and pediatrics yes, yes that is in the short subjects and, and uh, we have to study all the 19 subjects all and 19 uh, subjects. the remaining subjects which are not included they will be studied uh, as al they will allied, be, uh, allied subjects. subjects so basically we have to study all the 19 subjects and then sit for the exam okay it is very tough <laughs> we all know uh, so basically this is the gist if we clear next one then we will go to uh, the internship and after internship uh, we will again have to face next two next exam two. and in next one the university practical exam will also be there finally a practical exam and after next two uh, next internship after internship there will be next two it is a practical based exam about the clinical postings uh, and uh, what we have learned in the internship and if we pass the uh, next two then we will get the certificate and we will uh, can see for the counseling okay pg counseling yes basically next two is a kind of licensing exam that we have to face after yeah. our internships okay so uh, after this we'll uh, continue with the process for registration yeah. of the mock test okay so first uh, query is that from which website we will register and uh, many students do not know this uh, so we basically uh, you have to search aims in the google like this in this aims i have searched okay so in this uh, aims uh, the website the www.aimsexam.ac.in so we'll click in this website okay and in this website we can see that in the this uh, left right corner the notification there is there is uh, some notice about yeah this the mock practical test context. okay there will be login paste then uh, we have to proceed for the basic registration basic form registration. so this one the basic registration form the first step is this okay after this uh, we uh, have to click on this click here okay so in this uh, we you can uh, read how uh, what you can see there are actually three compound things that is composed of basic details yeah. and uh, image details and print basic candidate details matlab aap jo sare documents vagera doge wo wahan se print hoke bahar aa jayenge ha pehla cheez hai email id phone number ye sab to basic lagega aur personal details lagega aur aapka aadhar card ye sab lagega aur scanned images scanned images ka aapko ye dikha de raha hu dikha de raha hu main theek hai yes hum log sab ready karke rakhe hain ha to kya kya important cheez aapko kaise aap banaoge ye photos how you will make these are all clear if you have not studied this you can refer to our video okay फर्स्ट यू विल क्लिक ए फोटो इन योर मोबाइल और समथिंग द बैकग्राउंड शुड भी व्हाइट कम्प्लीटली व्हाइट होना चाहिए तो उसके बाद फोटो खींच के आपको वो भेजना है कंप्यूटर में कंप्यूटर में भेजने के बाद आपको कुछ भी ऑनलाइन में आप कुछ भी सर्च कर सकते हैं इमेज रिसाइजर बहुत सारे ऐप है वहाँ पे आप लोग जो रिसाइजिंग जो होता है वो वाला आप पिक्सल से आप सेंटीमीटर में कन्वर्ट कर लीजिएगा ओके पिक्सल से सेंटीमीटर कन्वर्ट करके यहाँ पे जो साइज लिखा हुआ है देखिए आपको दिखा दे रहा हूँ बेसिकली यू है 
size only. Okay, okay. for this proportion. So this is the size for the photo, 3.5 into 4.5 yes. width into height. Okay. Uh, so you have to resize this. Uh, in online, many websites are there. Online websites, uh, you can resize it. And the size uh, should be between the uh, 50, 50 to 100, 100 kilo. Kilo. So these are the two highlighting points. Okay. You uh, should keep in mind for this photo. And for the uh, signature, you have to do the same thing. Uh, first, you you uh, will take a white page, a white page of. Uh, then you will have to sign, and then you will um, have to take the picture, and then you have to crop the image in uh, that. So this is the. Uh, size. It's uh, about the signature details. Okay, we you so have to upload there. Okay, so and first you have to give a sig your signature, your own uh, autograph, and you have to draw a box around it. So this is the size of the signature, three into six. Okay, no, yes. please note down this. And uh, these are the highlighting points you should uh, keep in mind. Uh, otherwise, your form may be rejected. Okay, three into six centimeters, and the pixel size means the size in KB uh, should be between twenty to hundred. Okay, twenty to hundred KB. It should be minimum. Okay. And uh, the final, uh, that is the thumb imprint. Thumb imprint, you, you have to uh, take a ink pad and that uh, your left hand thumb should be recorded. Okay, like this, I have also done. Okay, uh, your multiple uh, attempt, up, multiple attempt, karke, up this, jo, uh, sabse best hoga, wo wala okay? I think this will be verified there now for biometric authentication. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think. When we go to the test, we will test it. It will be verified. It will be verified. It will be verified. It will be verified. 4 into 3 cm. This size is noted. And the pixel size of KB is the same. 20 into 100. So, the main pixel size of KB is 50 to 100. And the rest of the other one is 20 to 100 KB. Maximum, we will keep it down to 100 to 90 or 80. And left thumb. Right thumb is not. Always left. So, basically, we have to proceed to basic registration form. And after this, we have to click here. And we have shown that uh, how you will make the images. कैसे आप लोगों को बनाना है images. ठीक है वो एक एक ready करके आप एक folder बना लीजिएगा. ठीक है एक folder में तीन items जो आपको लगेगा. और अगर आपका category certificate है या PWD certificate है तो उसका PDF भी लगेगा. PDF. ठीक है. तो वो वाला भी रख लीजिएगा. तो let's proceed. Okay. So after this we have we can see this three columns. Okay. So these are basically three columns. Basic details, upload image, and basic print basic candidate information form. Okay. So let's do it. Okay. Proceed. We have to click the proceed. So this is the this form. Is the form. Uh, at first on the basic details form, you have to enter your full name and confirm your full name. There is father or guardian's name, mother's name, date of birth, confirm date of birth. Then you have gender here, then your category and your PWD categories, vagera, vagera. nationality, ID proofs, place of issue, where you have ID proof issue. Hua, hua hai. Then contact details, there will be, you have to fill up your contact details. Identification mark. Identification marks. Okay. Email ID, phone number, Adver or address details. Okay. फिर परमानेंट एड्रेस और परसोनिंग एड्रेस सब का जो भी है वो कर लीजिएगा उसके बाद ये आई डी क्लियर वाला चेकबॉक्स ये करके रजिस्टर करना पड़ा उसके बाद आपका आएगा अपलोड इमेजेस ठीक है सो लेट मी फिल अप दिस फॉर माई सर एंड आफ्टर दैट विल शो द अपलोड इमेज ओके सो बेसिकली वी हैव कम्प्लीटेड द फर्स्ट स्टेप एंड इन द फर्स्ट स्टेप वी हैव टू फिल अप ऑल द फॉर्म्स एंड आफ्टर दैट वी आर गिविंग द योर फोन नंबर इन द फोन नंबर यू विल बी सेंड द पासवर्ड एंड द रजिस्ट्रेशन नंबर एंड विद दैट यू हैव टू लॉग इन इन द फर्स्ट होम पेज एंड यू विल गेट दिस पेज ओके आफ्टर दैट पेज यू विल गेट दिस पेज आफ्टर लॉग इन योर पासवर्ड इट विल सेंड इन योर एस एम एस तो आपके एस एम एस में आ जाएगा वो ठीक है तो ये वाला पेज में आपको दिख रहा है कि क्या है रुकिए इसको थोड़ा ऊपर कर लेते हैं इन दिस पेज यू हैव टू बेसिकली एंटर योर स्कैन डॉक्यूमेंट डिटेल्स योर सिग्नेचर योर फोटोग्राफ योर कास्ट सर्टिफिकेट एंड अदर थिंग्स एंड योर थम इंप्रेशन सो यू हैव बेसिकली यू हैव दो बेसिकली ऑल थिंग्स ये यहाँ पे फोटो अपलोड करना है तो वी आर चूजिंग द फोटो ओके सो आई हैड मेड ए फोल्डर ऑफ माई सेल्फ यस सो दिस इज द फोटो आई हैव चूजन ओके द बेस्ट फोटो ऑफ सो दिस ओके सो एक्सेप्ट फोटो अपडेट सक्सेसफुली What happened? Please select photo to upload. Yes, sir. Please go below the page. No. Oh, sorry. Uh, we have to for upload the signature. Yes. I have made all this in a single folder. Boom. For my ease. Okay. So this is the signature. Okay. This is also uploaded successfully. And thumb impression. Okay. Thumb impression. Basically, it is old pattern according to us. So this is uploaded. Okay. So the second step is done, and after this, yeah, we are doing the submit. Yes. So, so this step two is also completed, and here is my form with details. You have to blur. <laughs> okay. No issues. So you will get this type, and you have to take print out of this page. Okay. Yes. See how beautiful the form is. So. So we are saving the PDF. Okay. So after the uh, registration process, you have to download the PDF that I have showed in previous uh, part. And after that, you have to wait for some time uh, for the verification of the uploaded images and uh, all the documents. Okay. And after that, you have to generate a unique code. Okay. You have to log in uh, in this page, and there will be option in the left side, generate unique code. And uh, after generation of unique code, uh, you have to log in again. Okay. So let me log in it. 
Uh, so after coming to this page, after login, there in the left side there is generate code. In this generate code, you have to click and generate the code. My code has already been generated. Uh, those who have not generated, generate it. Okay. Then log it out, and after that, we have to log in again with this generate uh, with this unique code E U C. Okay. There are actually three columns that is your registration ID, examination unique code, and password, and that captcha that is mentioned here. So you have to uh, generate the examination unique code EUC code you have generated in the previous slide, and uh, you have your registration ID and password. So we'll go uh, to the next page by registering and login to the page. So after uploading images and printing the basic registration form, you have to upload your qualification details. In qualification details, you have to give your college mark sheets and all what qualification and what course you are in. Okay. Uh, then you have to go to the make payment phase. That is your qualification details that you can see here. There is qualifying exam details, academic details, and then you have to go to the make payment page. Then you have to choose the exam center, and you have to at last print the final registration form, and your registration is done. The registration fees for this exam will be all candidates two thousand rupees, uh, except you are belo you are belonging to any kind of categories like SC, ST, OBC, EWS. Or OBC is not included. OBC is not included. General and OBC two thousand. General and OBC is two thousand minus three, and EWS, SC, ST one thousand. Okay. So uh, you will complete all these uh, processes. Okay. This I will not show. Uh, you have to complete all this qualifying exam. Uh, your college, we have to like MBBS. This is MBBS, yes, Indian, exam, Indian exam. University. Um, next day, then MBBS will be studied. Other courses will not be taken. Yes, all have to do. Then here, you will have to add your marks, your aggregate marks, the total marks, first and second. Add them. Then you will full marks here. Then you will get marks after here. Percentage will be given. Marks will be given. No. Okay. After payment, you will get a certificate. Yes, it is easy. Okay. 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 और कुछ भी क्वारी क्वेरी होगा कुछ अदर रिलेटेड भी आप लोग कांटेक्ट कर सकते हैं कमेंट सेक्शन में बोल सकते हैं ठीक है एंड सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल द बॉम्ब मेडिकल्स हमको भी ज्यादा नहीं पता है लेकिन आपके लिए जान लेंगे ठीक है हेल्पलाइन में फोन करके चलिए बाय